Today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Catherine of Sweden, the fourth child of the Swedish prince Ulf Gurmarsson and of Saint Brigid. Catherine was educated at the convent of Riesberg. At the age of 14, she was married in deference to her father's wishes to a pious nobleman of German extraction, Egard von Kuhnen, a lifelong invalid with whom, by mutual consent, she lived in continence. Saint Catherine was widowed in 1349 and was thenceforth in Rome at a saintly mother's side, aiding her in all her charitable endeavors and imbibing her ascetical way of life. In 372, the two widows made a pilgrimage to the Holy Land, and when Bridget died in Rome two years later, Catherine brought her body back to Sweden and had it interred at the Bridgetine Mother Convent at Vatstena. She then became the head of that foundation and ruled it with great skill. She took an active part in resolving the ecclesiastical controversies of the time, steadfastly supporting Urban VI against the anti-pope Clement II. From 1375 to 1380, she was in Rome promoting the cause of her mother's canonization and returned to Sweden with formal papal approbation of the Brigittine rule. Catherine died at the abbey of Vatstena on the 24th of March 1381, and though not formally canonized as such, veneration of her memory as a saint has been approved by Pope Innocent VIII, who reigned from 1484 to 1492.